a transistor for those components always here we have the base collector emitter so between collector and emitter you have to get basically the same reading as the diode we have about 800 drop voltage okay 800 drop voltage if we swap the probes normally we should not get anything but if you get about 1000 means good why because the transistor is connected to the board you see we have 1100 okay this is normal guys why normally we should not get here anything but because the transistor is connected to the board and in parallel with other components that's why we get 1000 reading so let's check another transistor on another circuit for example let's check this one here this one the same we have here base collector emitter okay so between the collector and emit emitter we have 600 drop voltage exactly as the diode 600 drop voltage okay but if i swap to probes i will get nothing or 1000 we have 1000 this is normal because it's connected but if we remove this tr transistor outside the board we we will not get anything here here also do you see guys the same reading let's see we have 600 about 600 here also about 600 okay for transistor for beginner the same reading as the diode between the emitter and collector